Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video. Here you see me separating my hair and I am getting ready to use the Coils by Nature brand. Um, I am first wetting my hair and getting it ready to detangle. I am first going to be using their detoxifying mango mint conditioner to um, detangle my hair. Um, I finger detangle and I also detangle with my denim brush. Um, this is my favorite part because I can see my curls before I even wash my hair. But looks can be deceiving. My hair is very dirty so it definitely needs to be washed. But I love to detangle with conditioner. It seems to um, work well on my hair and seems to have my, keep my hair very moisturized um, throughout the time that I have it's styled um, in here, yep, just detangling my hair, and I'm going to be twisting it up, and this is another wash method that um, I use sometimes, and it's just a quicker way of washing my hair for me, um, and I'm going to do all the sections like this, I'm going to detangle them, twist them up, and then I will... Um, Get ready to wash them that way. So I wash my hair in the shower. So um, I've already detangled my hair. Detangled with the conditioner. And I'm going to wash with it too. So what I want to do in the shower is, um, I, don't, I can't film in the shower, but uh, what I'm going to do in the shower is that I'm going to uh, put water on my hair, like drench it in water, and then use this and scrub my scalp. Alright y'all, so I am out of the shower, and I am t-shirt drying my hair a little bit, just so it's just a little bit dry, that's just how I like to do it. Um, when I'm doing the twist out, because I don't like my hair to be too wet. Um, so while I'm getting dressed, I just put a t-shirt on my hair and let it um, soak up some of that water out. Um, but I'm not going to leave it on for too long. And I'm actually going to go ahead and take it off. So you can see my scalp is pretty clean. So now I'm going to be using their leave-in conditioner. Um, this conditioner had really good slip and um, I felt like my hair wasn't soaking wet anymore so that's how I can determine whether this uh, conditioner had good slip. So I'm finger detangling again because I don't know my hair just tends to be tangled up a lot. Um, I didn't use my Denman brush again I don't think but um, I definitely got through the strands of hair with my fingers and got that product in there. It does look like it's sitting on top, but it's really not. It's, I got it all in there eventually. Um, so I'm pinning up one side of my hair. I'm only going to be doing two twists per section. Um, so they're going to be like medium twist. And I'm going to be using the herbal um, gel that they have. And I'm going from ends to um, scalp and it is already clumping up my curls as you can see they look so good I can't wait to do a wash and go on this because it was already looking good so I'm gonna do a wash and go next time like for a wash and go so I'm um, just gonna twist up each section like I said before it's just gonna be medium twist not too big not too small um, I don't have the patience for the small twist and then the big ones don't dry fast enough um, so this size usually works for me um, for me to get the curl pattern that I want and I added a little bit more product to the ends of my hair just to make sure that I keep the ends really good I really really like this, this gel um, it wasn't sticky it didn't feel like it was gonna make my hair um, all overweighted and um, I didn't feel like I just had it didn't feel like I had gel in my hair period 
Um, so yeah, I'm just doing this section. I'm going to do the same thing for each section. Um, and I can't wait for you guys to see the final results. And I really do think this method of putting um, the product in your hair really helps with what the final product comes out to. So my hair is fully twist now. I am going to let it dry. I think I'll go ahead and let it dry overnight because I definitely want to make sure I get, um, want to get the most out of the products that I use today. They look so good and moisturized. I can't wait to see how it comes out. And my face is all ashy. That's because I haven't put any moisturizer on. But I will see you guys in the next Hello. Video. So it is time to take the hair down. Let me put this up a little bit. Yeah, we'll do like three though. All right, and I can't wait. I'm so excited. They look so good. They shrunk up real good. It is dry, as y'all can see, these were medium it's yeah medium size twist i didn't do the little twist i don't have the patience for it okay let's get to it <sighs> this is what i used to take down my hair i am castor oil seems to be the only oil that uh, my hair really takes to um, it actually, I actually feel like it penetrates my hair and makes my hair, um, a little bit more moisturized, um, than the product itself does. Um, any other oil that I have used really hasn't worked for me. My hair sucks it up and then it's gone. So, <laughs> castor oil works for me. And, um, as you can see, those twists came out so good. The ends were curly. My hair was curly. I have a different, um, texture throughout my hair. So, the back of my hair is a lot curlier. But, it came out really good. I was so loving this. Like, this was such a good twist out. And this product really came through for my hair. Um, as you can see, the texture gets more kinkier as I get to the middle of my hair. Um, the back of my hair is very curly, um, a lot more curlier than um, the midsection of my hair in the, the front. I don't know, maybe it's the way that I do it, working from back to front, or I don't know. But it came out really good, I loved it. And here I am taking my hair out. I think I kind of over separated in a couple sections, but I'm down with the frizziness. I don't care about frizz at all. But um, this is me taking my hair out. And um, I've had some people say, you, it looks like you're hurting yourself. And it doesn't hurt, y'all. That's just how I do it. I'm just a little bit dramatic, that's all. Um, but yeah, um, getting rid of those lines, I can't really see the back of my hair, I can see it now because I'm like watching this and talking to y'all, but, um, I think I do pretty good for someone who can't see the back of their head or doesn't have a mirror to see the back of their head, um, when they're picking the hair. 
picking um, their hair out, but look at my curls, y'all. This came out so good. Um, I was really loving it as I was picking it out, and uh, I wish I could hear like my commentary and stuff, but look at my hair. This looks like a braid out, like seriously. My braid outs only have this much hair. Look at that. This is after I had got it all, you know, teased it a little bit, had it um, the way that I wanted it. I didn't put anything on my edges. I'm trying to not put so much stuff on my edges because they're already thin. But you guys, I love this product. And I really, really hope that you try this out and you're watching this video because you want to try it out. Thank you so much for watching my video. I will see you guys next time. Bye. Oh yeah, don't forget to like and subscribe and of course comment and let me know how you guys like the video.